Dean made it difficult at the end, but another win. Great bleeding win. Made it difficult. Tough to come here. No one just comes here and wins. The wind took up at the second half. You know, they make, they make entries, they're physical, you've got to stand up to it. I thought Jerome Akima was absolutely outstanding. What a performance that was from him. At the end, he's got to make that tackle. These are really difficult teams to play against. I thought people looking at the league table want to snap out of it. We've no right to just win football matches. You've got to earn the right, mate. And I thought we were outstanding today. Real gritty, dogged performance. A little bit cold here. Mate, like down in London up here, mate. So uh, I thought we were brilliant. Um, and a great win. Delighted for Hartigan. Delighted for Stead to get off the mark. Real team performance, that. There's going to be more of these coming our way with the winter coming in. So good test for us. Um, fair play to Russell and his team. They come after a second half. They pressed us. Um, but they got a little bit more direct. And to be fair to them, they ask questions of us. And in the end, we come up with the answers. Earlier in the season, we had a performance against Eastley where we were leading. And then obviously, that what happened happened. Today, it almost felt similar, but didn't, we kept the win. Does that show how far the mentality has come this season? Who had the best chances in the first half? I thought they had two great chances in the first half. We scored a free kick, that's a great goal. And Steady had a chance. We had no real chances in the first half. When we were away at Eastley, we should have been about 10 nil up at half time with a dominant performance. And they had four attempts on their goal. These are more attempts today. They played different, they played direct, they played long, they're physical. Um, and we just had to stand up. Like the the breeze started coming this way and obviously coming in against us. All right, there's loads of things we can all do better, but it's a great win. I, just, I don't understand when they're saying to me what a win that is here. Obviously, a nice early goal, Hartigan's free kick. Is that something that he's been practising on the training field? Yeah, of course. Yeah, he's, Jesus, you don't pass the ball like he does if you don't practise, mate. Yeah, what a free kick. Good kid. Spoke to him actually before the game. Can he chip in more goals from the edge of the box? It's a great free kick. Excellent goal. I thought our second goal as well, Stead's goal, was a brilliant goal. We penetrated them. Great run down the side. Great cross from Pritch. You know, Pritch is getting involved and you know, chipping in with goals and scoring goals again when everyone was doubting them. So I don't know why they were doubting them because I never did. And uh, Stead as well, a great performance midweek. Unlucky not to get on the score sheet, but got on it today. Yeah, look, good for Stead. He's an attacking player. We want him to play more as a central forward, but he's not ready for that yet. He's still learning the game. The thing is with Stead, he gives his all. He's put, he put his body on the line. nicky has been through a lot of games. That's when we took him off within the game itself. I didn't think it was Nicky's best game for us. And he just looked tired. He looked a little bit fatigued, so I put it down to that. And uh, look, it's been difficult. We just played Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday. I think it's that now we, well, I think, what was it? We were playing something like eight games in five weeks. Um, and we've got to do it again this Tuesday. So we'll recover, move on to the next game, and respect the FC Foyle, we'll respect every team in this division. Um, what I want to get across to everybody is we just haven't got the right to win things. This is why I'm not on social media. There's so much rubbish chatted on it. Um, my biggest thing with this is you have to earn the right to win every game of football in this division. And we've done that today. That's a bare minimum for us. Week in, week out, we're starting to do that. Just to think that we're going to turn up and win football matches. And we want to, smell, uh, want to wake up and smell the coffee. That ain't going to happen here. Russell Penn's a good manager. He's got a team promoted. And they ask a lot of questions. There'll be long throws both sides. And we stood up to it today. So it was a different test for us. Um, could we control the game better? Yeah, of course we could. We all want to control the game better. We all want to be Barcelona or Man City. I'm afraid that's the reality. It's not going to happen. Not every week in this division. So my biggest thing today is our togetherness. Delighted for our supporters. You know, good amount of them come up today. It's difficult to come up. And um, I'm delighted we've gone home with the victory. I just don't want us taking for granted winning football matches. It's a long, long way to go. 29 points from 14 games, is that correct? Yeah. So, you know, we've just got to keep going on our points per game average and see where it takes us. Dean, thank you for your time. Cheers.